Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2, War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken, that's the legendary Iron Man Army of Turon, and today we're going to beat the game with only two soldiers on the highest difficulty. More precisely, we're destroying two alien facilities. This is a double trouble um, uh, episode. We're going to do two uh, alien facilities in just one episode, making it swift and merciless. And probably we're going to use two different uh, teams as well, uh, Edgar Alien Poe and Dragonova for the first, and uh, Renven plus Kim for the second. And since no one needs any more loot or uh, experience, we can actually just go for the target. It's one of the few missions where you effectively just need to finish the mission objective without killing everything. So we could use that to our advantage. We have a positive confirmation on the position of a facility conducting research crucial to the Avatar project in this region. The coordinates are locked in for a tactical strike. Move to the designated position and plant the X-4 charges. Once they're armed, move to minimum safe distance and we'll turn that place into rubble. Alright. Copy that. Dragonova and Edgar Limpo are ready. Mainly Dragonova is going to be ready in this mission. Edgar will just lay back and enjoy the show. Dragonova begins to move in. As far as I'm concerned, we just need to get there. Um, keep Edgar and Poe in a somewhat um, hidden position. And then we can um, blow this whole place up. Vault says I am to obey. I can hear a sector port. All right, we located the first enemy squad. Nothing to be concerned about. They're just patrolling the area, really. If we were to grapple, we could grapple over here. That's uh, the only thing that's important for now. Okay. Let's move in. Again, another pack. Now we wait. So far, so good. Going to prepare and uh, to create a new door. Two specters. That's a new uh, pack combination as well. Okay. 
So this here should open up the wall. Look like a charm. You're near the target position. No need to ask this here shouldn't uh, trigger anything. So we were out of line of sight. Everyone's now in high alert. Those guys might run into us, but that's fine. Okay, so let's take a short look. We could go to here, perfect, which means call Sky Ranger to exactly here. Good. Next up, Dragonova moves in. Moving out. No place for you to go now. Oh, even more enemies. Interesting. Dragonova begins to explode at everything. There we go. We're being spotted out. X4 charges are armed. Move to the extraction point for immediate evac. We're being even more so spotted out. being spotted out and everyone spotted out well guess what guys We're already one step ahead time to give an advanced teamwork over And realize that luckily you do have another advanced teamwork. In short order. Triggered the last pack. Now we have finally triggered the entirety of the map. Another advanced teamwork. Dragonova is moving in and is leaving. And so are we. Take care, farewell everyone, enjoy the explosion. Easy peasy. First mission done. Take mark. Hashtag No Man Left Behind. We must never allow these dissidents to fill our hearts with fear. Their victory today is a minor footnote in history, a small bump on the path of salvation. The so that's why I wanted to put at least two, uh, two of uh, the missions into this uh, episode. To not say, yeah, great, six minutes. See ya, that was today's episode. Have fun, guys. About your capabilities, Commander. Excellent work, as always. Your team did a commendable job in destroying the alien's facility, Commander. Their efforts towards the Avatar project... Uh, just out of curiosity... Set back by your incursion. And they are not even tired. Is this for real? They are not tired? Okay. I guess we're doing another mission then. No, thank you. We're investigating that just a little bit later. Setting course for Sector 1, the Arctic.
Because apparently that hasn't uh, hasn't worn on their willpower. We can just do another mission with Edgar Lienpo and Dragonover. I also realized uh, that Zir Kim and Renman both are still tired, so technically we can't use them. Good, and I'm even considering maybe, you know what, might as well do all three of uh, the uh, facilities in one go. And whilst doing so, let's think about what the advantage of it is. Um, everyone knows uh, that the uh, that the um, Doomsday counter uh, is going to be reduced, but there is a second advantage, which is uh, alien progress is being reduced. So. That means uh, the background counter for creation of a new facility is not always reset, but it is prolonged. Um, so if if you continue to do that, uh, they will have a harder time building up new facilities. Just something to consider if you find yourself in a game where it's currently cascading in one direction, and you get a couple of um, uh, a couple of. Uh, dots into into one direction. This here really slows down quite a bit. Oh my gosh! We're blessed with four. Holy moly. Okay, so we're moving in. Matter of fact, everyone's moving in. The mission itself was already only classified difficult, and now we even steal one of uh, their troops. So they are currently having like eight enemies within this map, which is almost nothing. I am at your service. No place for you to go now. Okay. Let's move over here. Okay, let's wait until the patrol is somewhat gone. Patrol isn't even patrolling. Okay, interesting, we got another tower over there. Good, slowly but surely, everyone's moving to the side. Patrol is still not moving, that's good. So we can move into here and basically open that. We could also just blow everything up, which is a likewisely valid strategy, I might say. Or we're keeping it for a bit uh, later. You know what? Why not? It's not even going to trigger a pack. Stand clear. Men 
Minus one five. You're near the target position. So we could pull ourselves all the way into these positions. Yeah, I'll just leave it at that. Everyone's still hidden. For the first time, these guys are beginning to move, interestingly enough. Meanwhile, the others are just standing there because after quite literally the entire stage has exploded, of course, nothing could be wrong, right? Here's the last pack. So we could go all the way up to here, which is perfect. That's exactly what we need. Scanning. On Overwatch. Yeah, next turn we're going to finish. All right, so he could get up all the way to here, which means we're calling in the Sky Ranger to this position. And Dragonova can reach uh, the extraction zone, that's even better. So plant the C4, become visible. Dragonova somehow magically duplicates herself. Yeah, Dragonova loses movement when she's not hidden, but that's okay. In her stealth form, she can move a little bit further. But like I initially uh, mentioned, uh, that is not a problem because we have already accounted for it. There we go. Dragonova moves over. Volk says I am to obey. Just out of curiosity. Yeah, I think we can hit a couple of them. The towers. Could certainly die. We could face off, which we, I don't want to do. I just want to get the Spectre because I don't like Spectres. Kind of a matter of principle here. Not even sure if that's going to hit. Probably not. Whatever. Out. All 
right, everyone escaped. I think by taking shots, though, that might not have been the most uh, clever idea ever. By taking shots, uh, I think they are now tired. They are maybe tired. But we killed a spectre. Like, that's worth it. Can't hate them enough. Right up there, um, after the Archons, spectres are definitely annoying as hell. Good, let's see if we are tired. If that's the case, uh, there is no third mission. If it's not the case, we can. We might as well get the third one. Yeah, we're kind of tired. Yeah, we're tired now. Your troops performed admirably, Commander. Destroying that facility will slow the aliens' development of the Avatar project. So, how long are we going to be tired? To further establish the resistance movement. Eleven days, really? Really, eleven days? Wow. Shen managed to pull a set of encoded coordinates from the vial. We All right. Whatever. Like Let's continue and, uh, and wait until uh, the guys are no longer tired. I think it's a little bit ridiculous, but it is okay. And we maybe leave that one facility there. I, tend to keep things Choose a Pick up their I was annoyed about too many facilities, so at least two of them are gone now. And it is time for a dark VIP mission. I think um, I'm not even sure if we have enough soldiers uh, because everyone's tired. But dark VIP missions are fun. This time in Northern Europe. Let's take a look. In terms of soldiers. In terms of soldiers, we would have Roby and maybe a lightly wounded Hawkbite. That is an option. I mean, yeah, why not? Uh, I could see how that could be fun. Uh, that is definitely one option. Like, how, how long is it until six more days? Hmm. Yeah, might as well do that. Anyways, that will happen in the next uh, mission. Thank you so much for watching today. Uh, I know it was more of a cleanup duty, but uh, I have a nice little dark VIP mission the next time that we see each other, which is going to be in just a couple of days. If you like what you've seen, uh, hit the like button um, and leave a comment. Uh, that always helps the channel. Thank you so much and have a great evening. Bye-bye.